Hey guys, beautiful Otaku here again. And today I'm doing a manga review of Blackbird by Kenoko Sakuroji. Again, sorry if I'm messing up the translation. Um, there's the front. It looks pretty dark, right? And I promised to not do a Magical Girl manga review the next time I did one. So, Blackbird was pretty far from Magical Girl, so, yeah. There's the side, the spine. It's done by Shoujo Beat. Here's the back. No picture, but there's a synopsis. And it's for older teen, because there's some on a not suitable for children parts in here. Little sayings, but yeah. Nothing crazy, but still, older teen is definitely a good reading for this book. But anyway, this manga is about a girl <laughs> named Sal and her friend moved away and then he comes back for her. He promises to come back for her. She keeps having this recurring dream about him saying he's going to come back and he comes back and only to find out that he's a demon. So she's a little bit freaked out about it and it's just basically her adventures with her friend who is a demon. Usually on the cover she looks pretty sad on most of the covers. I mean the covers start to get a little bit more interesting but yeah that's the synopsis. I'm trying not to give everything away because it is a really good read so I guess I need to open it up. Here's a couple. It's Japanese style so I can only do it with one hand. I promise I will get a tripod at some point. I keep saying that, but I really, I will I'll have to eBay it or something. I'm sure they're not expensive. I just need to stop being lazy. But the artwork is pretty nice, even for it being a pretty dark manga. I see it's pretty awesome so yeah go check it out especially if you're in a like super dark well not super dark but dark romance type stories that's Blackbird Kanoko Sakuroji good read go check it out this is beautiful otaku saying don't forget to comment like and subscribe till next time guys see ya